I help you try to figure out how to get those four dates that we talked about up on the whiteboard. Okay? We have two solstices and we have two equinoxes. The two equinoxes happen to land on the exact same uh, altitude, okay, at noon. Um, the um, solstices have different numbers. So write these things down, okay? So I'm going to start with the summer solstice, and I want to know what date it's going to be on, in 2020 in the northern hemisphere because we're north of the equator, right? So I just Googled it. And I just did summer solstice 2020, and it gave me the date. So I'm going to write this down on a piece of paper somewhere. I'm going to say, um, try to find a piece of paper here. Okay, so um, summer solstice. is June 21. Okay? This is going to become this is going to come this is going to be important for you a little bit later. This June sorry, this June 20th. Right? And I'm going to change it now. I'm going to do um, autumn equinox. Autumn Equinox 2020, September 22, September 22nd, okay? Now I'm going to move to my winter solstice. So autumn just means fall, okay? It's just another word for fall, like your fall semester, when the leaves fall down from the trees. Okay, uh, winter solstice, 2020. December 21, winter solstice, 2020 is December 21. What do we have left? The spring. Another word for spring is vernal. Okay. Um, the vernal equinox. Twenty twenty. March nineteen. So, vernal equinox, which is the spring equinox, northern hemisphere, is on Thursday, March 19th. So, I'm going to write March 19 on my little piece of paper. Okay, so we're going to close that out now. I don't need this anymore. Um, but I'm going to go to another website, okay, and that website is called the Sun Earth Tools. Uh, let's just do that in another video, actually, okay? I'm going to stop that right there.